have been actually dealing this chapter for especially for board examinations. Already we have done some videos on tricks and trips also. So, that is for especially meant for entrance examinations. Even sometimes this type of question may appear in competitive entrance examinations. Just write down direct answer. I already told you how to find out sin of log x derivative means cos of log x into derivative of log x is 1 by x. So, that we get cos of log x by x that easily we can write it, we can easily visualize. So, that visualization is very very important for the competitive entrance examination. But what is the difference between the board examination and competitive entrance examination means only one difference that is in a within stipulated time we have to write the answer. In board examination we have to write the step wise the answer solution must be written that is very very important. So, here especially for board examination in this our videos also we follow the step wise method. Let us move to the this problem now. Find the derivative of y is equal to sin of cos of x square solution given y is equal to sin of cos of x square. Generally these problems seem to be difficult for even diploma or technical examination students or intermediate students for even sometimes for engineering students also. But its chain rule is very very easy method. So, what is the chain rule means first to find the derivative of sin, next to find the derivative of cos, next to the derivative find the derivative of x square. That means, we are able to write the derivatives of three functions. One is sin x function, cos x function and x square function. Then easily we can solve this problem using chain rule concept. So, let us do it. So, differentiate with respect to x dy by dx is equal to d by dx of sin of cos of x square. Okay. First let us write sin derivative that becomes cos of cos x square. Now into derivative of d by dx of cos of x square. this part is completed. Now, we have to find out derivative of cos x square multiplied by this one. So, cos of cos x square, what is the derivative of cos? Yes, you, you are correct that is minus sin of x square into d by dx of x square x square. Okay. Now, minus into plus minus cos of cos of x square sin of x square x square derivative is 2 x. The terms can be rearranged using associative property. So, let us rearrange the terms. So, 2 x into so that means minus minus 2 x sin of x square into cos of cos of x square this is the final answer. Okay. You might have understood the method the chain rule is very very simple. Let us move to the next problem. Find the derivative of y is equal to cos of 
log x plus e power x. So, let us solve this problem. Given y equals to cos of log x plus e power x. Differentiate both sides with respect to x. Now, derivative of y is dy by dx. Next, d by dx of cos of log x plus e power x. So, let us write the first derivative of cos. What is the derivative of cos x? That is minus sign of something. So, let us write here minus sign of log x plus e power x, do not forget it. Next derivative of log x plus e power x we have to write d by dx of log x plus e power x. Just check the problem. This is in the form of u plus v. So, d by dx of u plus v is du by dx plus dv by dx. So, that means derivative of log x plus derivative of e power x we have to write. So, now this becomes minus sign of log x plus e power x multiplied by derivative of log x is 1 by x plus derivative of e power x is e power x. So, this is the answer. So, let us discuss next problem find the derivative of y is equal to cos of log of cot x. So, let us concentrate on this problem. First derivative of cos is minus sin x, next log x derivative is 1 by x, next cot x derivative is very very important that is minus cosecant square x. So, now if you just concentrate on these three formulae and besides that if you concentrate on chain rule, easily this problem can be solved. Okay. Let us solve this problem now. Given y equals to cos of log of cot x, differentiate both sides with respect to x. Now, this becomes dy by dx equals to d by dx of cos of log of cot x. Okay. Let us find out the derivative of cos of log of cot x. First cos derivative that is minus sin of log of cot x should be written. Already the cos derivative have been evaluated. Now, we have to find out the derivative of log of cot x. So, we can write d by dx of log of cot x. Now, it is a turn of log of cot x. What is the derivative of log x? That is 1 by x. You can expect what is the derivative of log of cot x? It is obvious that 1 by cot x and cot x derivative has to be multiplied. So, we can write minus sin of log of cot x. Now, log of cot x derivative is 1 by cot x into d by dx of cot x. So, next step follows this equals to 
minus sin of log of cot x. This 1 by cot x is reciprocal of tan. So, 1 by cot x is tan x into derivative of cot x is minus cosecant square x. If you wish you can simplify otherwise you can leave the problem up to this step. So, this can be written minus into minus plus cosecant square x into tan x into sin of log of cot x. So, once again if you wish you can simplify this part also otherwise you can leave it.